Hey everyone, it's Sonushri. Welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you a new technique of applying blush, bronzer and highlighter. This is a very new technique which I have figured very recently and I think this technique works really well and this technique will give you a very sculpted cheekbones and a very fresh blushy look. And I think I'm the first one who has uh, figured out this technique. I don't know whether someone has already done this technique. If you, if someone has done this technique, then let me know that in the comment section down below. And if you guys want to learn this new technique, then keep on watching this video till the end. And if you haven't already, then subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated. And now let's jump into the heck so i have named the new technique uh, as fish tail because the blush looks like a fish tail it goes just like a tail and in between the tail there goes the bronzer so i named it fish tail and i have also like used the fairy lights at my background and i have made a fish kind of looking figure as you guys can see in the back it looks like super cute to me i already have my base makeup on as you guys can see i have already put on foundation concealer powder mascara eyebrow gel then a little bit of lipstick and lip liner so that's all from my base makeup and i haven't put blush because i'm gonna show you how to do it so let's do it so I'm gonna put on blush and I'm using this one and this is called the wet and wild blush and this is in the shade hello first I'm going to coat my brush with this blush you do not need to take a lot uh, take moderate amount if you think you have taken too much then you can slightly dust it off like this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply it in a fishtail shape that means I'm gonna go like just like this and then I'm gonna go just like this just like the tail that's in my background <laughs> so let's do it all that's like not showing the shape but putting the blush in that way will make your face look more sculpted and it goes also underneath the bronzer because i have left this space out i have put it in that motion so you're gonna put your bronzer right here and there's also a little bit of blush going underneath the bronzer so it makes your face uh, look more like fresh blushy rather than making it look more of like a black canvas that's the reason i put a blush like that and if you want to apply a little bit more you can also do that because i'm gonna do it now Now we will move to the other cheek. So I'm done with blush and now I will apply some bronzer just in the space uh, which I have left out. I'm using the XX Revolution bronzer, this one. This is in the shade Chaos. You can use any bronzer you want. So firstly, I'm taking a little bit of bronzer and I'm gonna dust it off. And I'm gonna apply it right into the space which I have left out uh, after applying the blush, which is right here. Now I will apply it in the other cheek. So I'm done with bronzer and now I'll tell you how to apply the highlighter I'm using the XX Revolution highlighter and this is in the shade Focus this is one of my most favorite highlighters so I'm using this one you guys can use whatever highlighter you want so I'm gonna take a brush which looks like this uh, I think a small brush would be good for highlighter and uh, that should be more like tapered or it can look like this I think uh, this kind of uh, densely packed brushes are better for highlighter. You guys can also use fan brush if you want. So I'm taking a little bit of this highlighter. I'm gonna also dust it off. And I'm gonna apply it right where my blush started. Right here. I also like to connect the highlighter to the brow bone. So you guys can also do that. Now the other cheek. 
try to apply the highlighter in a circular motion then it will blend better. So there you have it guys, this was my fishtail technique and this is a really brand new technique of applying blush, highlighter and bronzer and I hope that this technique will be helpful for you. And if you haven't tried this technique then I suggest you guys that you try this technique and give it a go and tell me how it is in the comment section down below. And I'll say it's a really good technique that will make your cheekbones more sculpted, your face look more slimmer and defined. So I think you should, guys should give it a go and if you found this video helpful and if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to thumbs it up, subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell to see similar videos from me and today's shout out goes to this comment. Congratulations to you and if you want to get a shout out in my next video then just comment on below and that's all for today thanks guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye